All right, one of my probes just read 207 miles an hour. Actually, I might want to ride this one out. I'm going to try. Yeah, the RFD ones on this thing are insane. I'm well outside of it. I'm still getting like 80 to 90 miles per hour. Actually, basically passing 100 occasionally. Oh, wait, hold on. Uh, oh, oh that's not good. The uh, uh, balcony just broke. Okay, I'm just driving into the main part. Uh oh, like oh my gosh, my front wall just blew out. My roof is gone. Everything is... Oh, everything most is... Most things are level. Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Today I am back in Twisted, continuing the storm chasing series. I'm joined by Jay Killen, Ben, and Tofu, and we're gonna chase some more tornadoes. So without further ado, let's get into the video. All right, so Jay Killen, as always, do you wanna explain the weather a little bit? Yeah, so similar to the last video, we actually have another three day high risk. Uh, for day one, we actually have a, uh, I guess like a pretty decent high risk. We have Cape that is in, uh, the range of around 3,500, which is actually pretty excessive. Uh, temperatures at 79 degrees, dew points at 61. So it's not like super high for dew points, but it is still quite enough, I'd say. For the lapse rates, it's not like super high either, but at the same time, it's it's basically favorable. For precipitable water, it is pretty high. It's approaching one and three quarters of an inch. And uh, for relative humidity on the surface, it's actually pretty low still. Uh, for SRH, we have 445 SRH, storm motions at 63 miles per hour to the east, and STP is at 7, VTP is at 2, and looking at the hodograph, we do have a pretty nice kind of art shape, but the way that it is kind of like positioned, it kind of reminds me of like a Dixie Alley-esque type hodograph, where it's like you don't have like a robust kind of sickle, it's kind of like a stretched sickle. And then like a strong veer back that kind of just goes off wherever. All right, so thank you, Jay Killen. And we've already got a storm, so let's get chasing. And uh, I guess, um, do you want to lead, Jay Killen? Uh, yeah, let me close my doors and we should be ready to go. All right, sounds good. Now, you mentioned Dixie Alley. Do you want to explain to the audience what that is? Yeah, so Dixie Alley, it's kind of similar to, uh, I guess, the terms like what Tornado Alley is. Tornado Alley, you have like the main central area for what's known for tornadoes, like in Oklahoma. Uh, north part of Texas, Kansas, and all those like kind of central states. Dixie Alley is kind of the southern states, like that includes like Mississippi, Alabama, parts of Georgia, Tennessee, basically in that sort of southern region, I guess north of where the Gulf of Mexico is. Wow, look how thick this rain is. Yeah. You can't see a single Very thing. Very thick rain and hail. Yeah, let's take a look at radar, and it looks like we do have some sort of rotation. It's directly over Funkley, moving northeast, towards Hazleton. Yeah, that might not be good. It not comes at all. This way. Yeah, we rarely actually get to see tornadoes head towards Hazleton super early in the chase. So I'm gonna turn this way, head south, and wow, we've got a lot of wind going on. Yeah, I think we're getting battered by straight line winds. I'm actually yeah, gonna go are. ahead and pull over a Tomcat performance and wait yeah. it out. Oh my I'm gosh. almost 90 miles an hour. Yeah, it's crazy. Uh, I got a visibility on it. It's a big wedge. Really? Oh yeah, I see that too, I see that too. Yeah, oh my it gosh. is huge. It's got it's a huge, huge wall cloud on it too. Oh my God. Uh, Jake Killen, how, what should be our game plan? Uh, I'm gonna go east on Keysota 53, trying to race towards that road that goes north through Welchill, or at right. least trying to get close. If not, I might turn around and come back up north to Hazleton. All right, I'm gonna get going. I do see the tornado now. Oh wow, yeah, that is a very large wedge. So um, I'm gonna turn here and I'm gonna see if maybe I can drive up on one of these roads over here, maybe get close to the tornado there is actually oh. a slight debris ball i think uh i can confirm that yeah well the winds are getting pretty strong can you hear that uh jay Kellen? i hear uh, it a little bit car. this is gonna be really risky to do oh, oh yeah the, starting to get yeah, some of the wind was, oh my yeah. gosh trees are getting tossed let's zoom in on oh, that it's violent i'm turning around oh, i'm turning around i'm gonna push through all right i'm turning around i don't, th oh I don't think God. i can get back out now this is violent. Okay, okay, I got it. it was like 120. I got 105 in my going. Going. I'm getting one, uh, almost 160. Yeah, oh I just God. barely pushed through that just yeah. in time. I'm escaping. I'm escaping. Holy cow, right, this is a is monster this tornado. Yeah, it is a monster. Yeah, it there. looks like it might actually go right into Hazleton if it kind of goes more northeast. Oh my God. Yeah, it's just consistently over 130. All right, I'm pulling over here and dropping. Here we go. Okay, I just exited the outer wall. All right, I'm getting out of here. 
So I can see that both the left and right edge are moving. Like the left edge is moving left, right edge is moving right. So that does mean it is coming towards me and okay. it's getting bigger. Where are you at? Uh, so I'm just outside of Hazelton. It is also a tornado emergency now, by the way. We're all gonna kind of converge. Uh, yeah, that's going right for a probe, uh, Jesse. Yeah, I just dropped another one. Yeah, this, this thing this is a massive gonna, wedge. Uh, yeah, look three. at the velocity. Let me take a look. That thing oh, is uh, oh my gosh. Look over 200. Look at that debris ball, dude. That thing's thing easily insane. over 200, probably. Oh my God. Whoa, what the heck? Something just flew around like crazy. Okay, I gotta get out of here. Yeah, you are in the outer circulation right now, Tofu. You gotta move. I'm now entering the funnel. 152. Yeah. Hey, Power flashes everywhere. Trees best. are going down. Yeah, this is insane. Oh my look God. The it, ball. Whoa. All right, deploying the drone. That is very heavy. This is not good for Hazen. Oh my gosh, the drone is freaking out a little bit. Trying to get yeah, control. Get to his my business is gone. It's non-existent now. Dude, that debris, there's like dark purple on the debris ball. The, the radar's getting knocked out from this, guaranteed. My yeah, drone is struggling. 189. Oh my gosh. Yep, this is it. My oh, drone's getting pulled velocity. into the tornado. I'm going free cam. Multiple I'm vortices. Hold on. If I get hit by a vort, like a, I guess a multiple vortex, then I'm I'm going to be done for. If it just hits me with one singular vortice, 196. Oh, okay. it's really thin too. I'm I'm in free cam right now. A lot of buildings are being destroyed. Oh yeah. Oh my gosh. I think I just saw a mobile home go flying. Oh yeah, I see that too. Oh my god, it's a bit laggy. There are flying mobile homes. All right, one of my probes just read 207 miles an hour. The other one oh my is god. at 162. So, yeah. Oh, nope. 216 now. All right, I'm in north. Got to get out of here. Yeah, I'm going I'm the wrong far, way. So it looks kind of goofy, but I'm, I'm getting mobile homes being flipped. Um, Actually, I might want to ride this one out. I'm going to try. Windows are getting ripped off in Hazleton. This is insane. Oh, hey, Jesse. I see you on my free cam. Oh, uh, well, I'm going to try to ride it out in one of these apartments. Be careful. This thing, you're probably going to die. It's just going I directly think I am for you. It, like, by now. All right, here we go. Purchasing a uh, apartment in Hazleton. All right, I'm going to keep a watch on your area, Jesse, here. Uh, winds are kind of starting battering, so I got some screen shake and a lot of stuff. But okay. this does not look good. Yeah, the RFD winds on this thing are insane. I'm well outside of it. I'm still getting like 80 to 90 miles per hour. Actually, basically passing 100 occasionally. Oh, wait, hold on. Uh, oh, oh that's not good. The oh, uh, balcony just jumping. broke. Oh, yeah, no, that's the winds. That's everything right there. Okay, I'm just driving into the main uh Oh, proper, like, oh my gosh, my front wall south. just blew out. My roof is gone. Everything is... Oh, everything most is... Most things are leveled. Um, yeah, my apartment's uh, just I got hit. I saw you. I just saw you fly around the funnel. I never heard winds like yep. this before. Your car is airborne. Yep, there it goes. Your car is getting sent away. The residential area of wow. Hazleton is just gone. There's right, nothing. I'm, I'm gonna zoom out. I never heard those wind sound effects before. This is violent. I, it was like literally whistling with how loud it was. I wonder if there's gonna be anything left of my apartment. I don't think so. From what I saw Probably before not. I pulled away back, it was almost a slab. What I found interesting was the building held on for quite a while. Then the balcony came off, the windows blew out. And then in quick succession, the wall blew out, the entire front wall, then the roof, and it was gone. Oh, this is a really stupid idea. I'm cutting across the field as it's right to my south. I can't see it. There's so much rain. I'm trying to go on dirt roads to even get in front of this thing. I am just in a chaser's nightmare, and I'm going for it full Yeah, send. I can see the uh, vortices. Like, I don't see a funnel or anything. It's just vortices on the ground. It's I not safe to heal people right oh now. God. Oh, my God. There's a vortice. There's a vortice I see right that. It's like racing like, right next to you. Yeah, this thing like re-intensified. Yeah. Oh my gosh. It kind of dropped down to maybe like 130 to 140. It just went back yeah, to like Yeah, it's still pink to the ass right now. Yep. Uh, this is very bad for me. Oh my gosh, it oh is God. still God. very bad. He's, I just saw him roll rapidly yeah, into the I'm field gone. and die. Oh my God. I was in free camp, so I got a very scary angle of that. Uh, I'm upside down, I survived, I survived, I survived. The winds are battering my car like, and uh, this is not good. New tornado on the ground down I'm south. I'm just sending one of my meds today. I'm flipped upside down. Yeah, still a... surviving. Oh yeah, my gosh, there are storm. two. There are yeah, two there, tornadoes. two embedded storms. I'm not going to go uh, damage assess. I'm just going to go down there to, um, yeah, go chase, to that. chase the uh, two tornadoes. All right, sounds I'm good. I'm upside down in the middle of this. I don't know how I'm alive at all. I think because I'm deployed, the game still thinks I'm deployed. Yeah, it takes forever to intercept this thing. Like, it's been like a good maybe two minutes, and I'm still inside of it. Like, Same basically. here. I'm like right in the funnel, too. I'm getting 120. I'm, I'm yeah, it's red down. TVS now, so it should probably be in the like 130 range. I'm gonna start so I think it should be fine. Yeah. 
You know Despite what? Being upside down. Why don't you guys continue um, with this tornado, see what the damage is, if you can heal anybody in Gemmel or Gemmel. And I'm going to go follow Ben, see what those tornadoes are doing. All right. Yeah, there's another uh, debris ball over Gemmel. All right, I'm core punching the uh, storm right now, so I've lost visibility. But uh, both tornadoes are going into Helma right now, and they look to be aiming towards Haram or Hiram and Nateville. Yeah, I'm, I'm directly south of that one down and directly north home. of the other one. I can't see either of them. Oh my gosh. Yeah, all the mobile homes here are pretty much gone. Uh, there's nothing left. I oh, I see, see you, Ben. I can see the tornado. It's... Oh, there it is. Wow. It's right there. Oh my gosh. All right, I'm going to hop in your Dominator. Yeah, that one tornado is still a huge wedge. Yeah, and we're going like, into the tornado right now. This is it. Oh my gosh, there goes my truck. Yep, I wouldn't have survived. It just rolled into a stop sign. Holy cow. Yeah, I think it's fine. What are our wins? Not much. Like, 130 max. Oh, wow. Yeah, this tornado is still moving northeast. Uh, we don't have a visual on the other one. I can, I can actually see them both. One's multi-vortex, one's a, a skinny stovepipe. Yeah, that's the one we just intercepted. Yep. I'm chilling in here on right now. I'm getting everything set up for its probably an eventual impact um yeah we're gonna try to get like up there perfect track but the problem is is we have almost no visibility because we are in the oh, core yeah. of the oh. storm ben slow down ben slow down it's here i'm good i think i can barely see the uh, southern one behind the uh, northern tornado i'm not good oh and there i go all right there's ben i just crashed by. Here we go. Hello, how are you doing? Hey, hey, uh, we're doing good. Taking up residence in the uh, Dominator 2 here. Oh, I see some of the dust cloud. They're freaking out. Yep, here we go. Oh, it's right there. It's right there. All right, I'm going to go into cinematic mode. I'm going to watch Same. this. I'm going to go into first person, actually. This will be a pretty are, cool oh, view. Whoa, 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 oh, my I gosh. See the letters falling off. That's so funny. Yeah, I just saw that <laughs> out the window. I got that. Oh, my God. My truck's holding on, which is nice. But, yeah, uh, hey, hey, I got the bug where I can drive deployed. Oh, oh, use it to your advantage. That is super rare. I think that was it. Wow. Oh, I think it went sort of north of our position. All right, so here we are. We're back in Hazleton, and the damage has been rated, and it's no surprise this was an EF5. And, Jay Killen, do you want to go into more detail as to why it was an EF5 and some interesting things from the damage we have here? Yeah, so the tornado uh, ended up basically coring through the central sort of south part of Hazleton, through the residential area, and a lot of homes on like the southeast corner have basically been completely slabbed. And there's two homes, I'm actually standing next to them, it's these upper bound homes that have basically been completely slabbed almost, uh, which have warranted the EF5 rating at 220 miles per hour. And this thing was actually fairly strong for a while. So from what I remember, when I first intercepted at the kind of the south part of Hazleton, it was around 211 miles per hour. And then even when me and Tofu intercepted up near, I guess, like west to 10 strike uh, before it hit Gemmel, uh, well, Tofu got rolled and almost killed. And I was still hanging on. It was about like 180, 190 miles per hour still. So it was still pretty strong for quite a while throughout its life. And then the other tornadoes, uh, one has went through Haram, one went near Haram. Uh, those weren't as bad, but yeah, I guess the main event was just that big one that kind of just went right through Hazleton and just did substantial damage. Well, then this was a pretty crazy experience. We got to witness a bunch of insane tornadoes, and uh, one of them actually ended up being an EF5. So that is something. And uh, if you guys have enjoyed this video, make sure to leave a like and a comment. And I'll see y'all next time, guys. Goodbye.